one of the things that was very a very very significant transformation for me over the past years, and I admit I'm still in the process of learning it, is going from that thinking that VCs and investors are, you know, counterparts that you have to convince to come along with you, mm. to thinking that they are actually partners that you're going on a journey together. And that's mm -hmm. a very, very significant nuance because in one scenario, it was very transactional for me. It was like, oh, this yeah. is a template that based on this, I have to tell my story very transactionally. They're going to look at it and say, nah, or yeah, sure. sure. You know, versus <clears throat> now that when I'm thinking about them as think about investors as, as potential partners, it becomes a dating process. It becomes a course. Definitely. Right. Yeah. It becomes a process where I have to tell a story about the growth that I'm imagining for this business, mm -hmm. how that growth is possible, how that growth is differentiated from other alternatives, and how the investors and myself, you know, and us as a team, as a company, are going to grow together. And, you know, right. what benefits we can give each other. So the conversation becomes a lot more interesting that way because, first of all, you immediately uh, can disqualify a lot of investors that otherwise uh, would not have been great partners for you. Definitely. Because the, the way they, they interact with you, the way they articulate their pieces, like all of those are important things because if you get married to this person, to this company, this is going to be a marriage for several years. Right, right.